It's always the first Wednesday at noon. I never knew that. Why do I have one bar? You have two bars on my screen. Oh. Why is my yeah. internet? Screen? You're showing us two. I'm surprised I have all four. Which is you, you show us three. Oh, I felt really weird from this oh, spot. I dropped down. You have four on mine. Dude, something's wrong with my internet. What is going on? Look, I've lowered my head so all you can see is my forehead. Maybe I should reconnect to connect if you're horny. That is a real Wi-Fi name in some apartment near me. To cut that part out. <laughs> yeah, that is not PG. <laughs> when has this podcast ever been PG? <laughs> yeah. choke on my wine. It's more like a PG-13. This is the Experience Podcast with me and someone else. It's Elizabeth. Peace signs. It's For our sad. listeners, Elizabeth has done tons of visual gags. For our visual only pot or for our audio only podcast. Noah, how's it going? It's going well. <laughs> and uh, Tanner man. will be joining us when he figures out his life. But this is our, uh, I guess our our episode two hundred spectacular. Oh, it is. Yeah, it's we made it. We made it. To... In the title of the meeting. It, it is in the title of the meeting. All you had to do was read. Um, uh, I don't see no title. Top of the screen. It says podcast. Not the top. Of, oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Uh, <laughs> brought in all the all the favorites, and Noah are back this week. Um, <laughs> I've actually, I think, for all of you, I've tried to get you on the past few weeks, and it kind of just lined up that this week worked out. Oh, yeah, it's on this week. Yeah, worked out. People have been traveling. People have been uh, working, going to events, trying to get their internet to work. That's a tanner. Shout out. I'm going to get a few events recently. Somebody's like very sociable. Like my program, like network, network, network. There you go. I feel like I talked about networking last time too. You did. I think the episode was called networking. Can't, can't do that again. Yeah. Can't do that again. How do you like your job? I'm loving it so far. My first uh, rotation. I'm pretty sure that's trademarked by McDonald's. Yeah, you, can't say you can't just say that. You gotta like. Yeah. I really, I really do enjoy it though. Um, my first rotation has been, I think, really. It's been really good. It was a really good first rotation. This is a very hands-on role. Um, I've been able to learn a lot because it focused on things a lot different than what I focused on during school. And that'll be finishing up at the end of June. And then I'm moving to New York State for my second rotation in July. Where? Outside of Albany. Right near me. I mean, not that close, but. A couple hours. A couple hours. Close I'm enough to move. Yeah. This summer, you guys should come visit me. Uh, we're, we're coming up here. We're doing the New York thing now. Yeah, you have to come visit us. Yeah. We're all in New York City. If I go after July and you're there, maybe I will. Okay. At the end of August, for like two weeks, I'm going to be in like Austin, so don't come. In where? In like Austin, in New York. It's just like we're traveling for training. Where New York? Austin. I don't know where that is. I That's a it. place. Yeah. I thought that was like a verb. Let me look it up. Say it again. Austin. <laughs> O-S-S-N-I-N-G, I think. Maybe I'm spelling it wrong. How come my computer uh, has connection, but my Google Maps has poor connection on my phone? Oh, so that's pretty far south. That's not near Albany at all. Yeah, like I'm going to have to travel for it. Look where oh, that's, in, that's, that's in Westchester. Okay, just say Westchester. I don't yeah, know you could have just said Westchester. Yeah, that's everyone there will just say you live in Westchester. Like, 
Does it count as Westchester? I don't even know. It's in Westchester County, so I assume it counts as Westchester. Is it? I can't. I'm looking at the. Yeah, I see. Yeah, you could just say it Westchester. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so you're going to Westchester. Uh, Noah, what is this chicken bone on a car in a parking lot? Is that? Oh my god! Room? I saw a chicken a bone on a car in a parking lot. That's that's the whole story. I saw is it there. And like, is it? I need to take a video of this. There is a chicken bone on a car. Definitely was like a drumstick at some point. Yeah, it was. A, I think it was. Just, yeah. He did. He left the it was small though. It's like a chicken wing drumstick, not a. You know, it's a small one, not a. Yeah. Full. Full guy. Someone had a snack. You see random chicken, chicken wing bones in Atlanta. Yeah. Where, Where else are you gonna put your? Yeah. Where's Tanner? He's he's working on coming back, I think. I don't know. Always something with him. That it's <laughs> always yeah. something with him. Yeah. Where is? What's that? So let's talk about the things I've done. Let's talk about me and my needs. Okay. What are your needs? I don't have needs. No, but I, I went to the, I went to the freaking Kentucky Derby. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. How did you go? Tell us all about that. I was very excited. Uh, you can just buy tickets and go. Uh, no. Uh, they're like they're infield tickets, so you can't actually see any of the race. Mhm. Mm but you're there. I mean, you can see the race on the screen, but you know, whatever. Out. I lost two hundred dollars. You... Well, I lost more than two hundred dollars because the fucking mint julep is seventeen dollars, and it tastes yeah. like okay, pretty good, but not seventeen dollars <laughs> worth of mint Woodford. julep. What? Woodford Reserve. That's the the bourbon they use. Yeah, and it was like eh. I could just get that a mint julep anywhere, and it tastes just as good. I feel like I don't know. But yeah, uh, so, um... Jack Harlow? Is that who it was that was there? What? Wasn't Jack Harlow there? Uh, I think so. But did I don't... you see him? Uh, yeah, I think he just did the one, like, On Your Horses or Riders Up or something, yeah, but I don't... I mean, I saw him on the screen. Yeah. Do we have this conversation about, like, famous people at the Masters or something? Yeah, I saw... I saw a bunch of quarterbacks at the Masters, but yeah, I was so at the Derby. Been, yeah, but at the Derby, well, I was in the infield. All the like, no, 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 no. If if you're okay. those people are all in the stands, like those tickets, I don't know how you get those tickets. Infield so was like for plebeians. Infield plebeians. What? Like inside the center of the track. Yes. Yeah. So there was so many people. Oh my God! You could not move an inch. Did you get a I hat? expected to be a lot of people, but I didn't expect it to right? So, uh, uh, you want to go to Kentucky Derby? So I'm like, okay, sure. That's how I that's how I went, Elizabeth. It was just that that easy. It was like eighty bucks a ticket. Ooh, steep. Is, is this computer working? Tanner. But yeah, it was fun, but it's not something I would do again, just because you can't see the race, first of all. I mean, besides on the screen, but, you know, at that point. Um, yeah, at that point, you could have just been watching it on your TV, I yeah. guess. Um, people are not the type of people I like to associate myself with. Um, let's just say that. If I had to categorize them as a group of people, I would say uh, very uh, Storm the Capital-ish. If that makes any sense. That makes sense. That might just be the whole state of Kentucky, though. I don't know. Um, Are you talking about yeah. the Kentucky White Derby people. or the, right. the NASCAR? No, uh, I went to the, the Kentucky 500. Derby. Okay. No, I went to the Kentucky Derby. Um, really? It's, it's So it's filled with people uh, from the capital Rednecks. Side? Yeah, red. I thought it would, yeah. I was thinking it would be like southern, I don't know, rich 
just like you know what I'm talking you about. You know, like, that's the st- okay. So that I was saying why you were working we're betting on horse racing. That's the people in the stands. The people in the infield oh. are rednecks. Although the people in the stands are probably there's a bunch, probably a bunch of rednecks too, but you know, richer rednecks. Terrence thinking about the old man in the cowboy hat. Yeah, no. Oh my God, the hats though. Big Every, mustache. Everyone had a hat. Crazy hat. Do you have a hat? I did, but it wasn't as crazy. Like it was a one, a two, on the scale. It was just a was hat. It, a it wasn't like a baseball cap. It was just a small. What was hat. the craziest hat you saw? They were, they were all. They weren't crazy hat. They were just all very large and colorful. What was the largest, most colorful hat you saw? I don't remember. There was like. Tens of thousands of people. I think I'm going to go to a horse race in Saratoga Springs this summer. Don't bet $200 and lose it all. Although I was very close to winning a lot of money. Like $3,000. The one came in second? Well, I I had bet in exacta, which is you have to get the first and second exactly right in that order. And those two mm-hmm. finished second and third. So, oh, you had the, whatever it was in Zane. I had second and third finishing first and second. So if the horse that was like the lowest shot had just died or something, let me, let me rephrase that. I just not won. I would have won a decent amount of money, but whatever. Yeah. It was, what was that? What was the horse's name? Third Which place one? was Friday. Second place? I believe it was Epicenter. Yeah, that that was Epicenter, yeah. Yeah. That was crazy. Yeah. Crazy horse race. Yeah. Zandon was I like Cincinnati race. though. I went to Cincinnati, that's where we stayed. I like that. Cincinnati was pretty was really cool. It's cool. Louisville, not so cool. I in, have in some my, in my humble opinion. Yeah, have you ever, did you guys ever go to Louisville? No, I I've been to Louisville. For the we we played them away once. Was yeah, that, yeah. that was. Did a you like the city? Did you like Louisville? I don't know how much you stayed and didn't. We didn't Louisville. see much of it. Um, that was fine. We we Part didn't. Of the football stadium <laughs> of Louisville. Yeah, the campus is huge. They have so but many sports. Uh, so many sporting places. Like they have one for freaking like field hockey. Yeah, they have all the stadiums. Like, like, make a multi-purpose place. Jeez, they have one for soccer. They have one for, like, I understand soccer having its own. I mean, yeah, I mean, but field hockey having its own. I mean, they can use not field hockey. Uh, Softball. No, what's field hockey? Softball, baseball, different size. Yeah, yeah, they need those need different fields. Yeah, no, but that, yeah, that, they often play at the same time. But it was, it was like soccer. I think lacrosse had its own one. Like, you could multi-purpose those all at the football store. So I don't know, just the whole it's freaking like the, thing. Uh, North Springs Field with the football, soccer, and lacrosse lines on it. Oh yeah, there you go. I don't know. You run. You just run that risk of just being it. It being too confusing. Maybe not. That's fair. Well, Daniel, it's the 200th episode. Do you have something prepared in celebration yeah. of that? I have a speech. Hold on, let me pull it out. That's yeah, yeah. No. Let's hear it. No, I don't have it. I don't have it. Tanner, go ahead. This is really okay. Well, I might have not prepared anything either. Um, uh, you clearly so... have something on your mind. No, I I don't. I I was just gonna see if we could segue into the your feature two hundred episode segment. And we can't, I guess. <laughs> Go ahead. I don't have anything. I, yeah, uh, I don't have we, anything we either. To, we mentioned it at the, at the top when, while you were doing whatever you were doing, hacking You're the so internet. quiet, Tanner. Dude, uh, I'm just technical difficulties. What if I talk on the mic like this? That's better. Better. I'm literally yeah. chewing on it. Yeah, put it all the way in your mouth. I could hear you fine. Really? Yeah, just turn your volume up then, Noah. Okay. But Daniel's really loud. All right, I'll start. 
Yeah, Daniel, just be a little bit quieter, okay? You're like a, I'm, you're an up here, I'm, and I need you to be a down here. Up here, and you gotta be down. Here. I'm projecting for the audience. Maybe even a little bit here. Yeah. You gotta project for the people in the back. Yeah. yeah. Work in a well, loud environment, so I see yelling. So, you know Tana, what? what do you got? Oh, go ahead. Elizabeth. No, Elizabeth was going yeah. Oh, I was gonna say, I recently started watching Letter Kenny. Have y'all watched Letter Kenny? What is that? I'm like, on oh, season two. It's super funny. It's on Hulu. And it's like about this town called Letter Kenny. And like the intro every time is like, there are 5,000 people in Letter Kenny, and these are their problems. And they follow like the farmers this group of like meth heads and then like hockey players. And it's so funny, it's very witty. Like I have to watch it um, like with the captions on cause they talk really fast. It's a very fast paced show, but it's so funny. Very clever. Just let me to give it another chance. I, I wasn't able to get into it. I, I thought maybe the jokes went over my head. Maybe I'm too stupid. But I didn't, that's, I didn't that's get good. the humor. Yeah, that's a good good possibility. The humor of that show is like just like the repetition of like every single time. That's what I likes about you, Katie. Oh, is that what you like about me? Like, I don't know. It just keeps going and there's like the whole to be fair. Yeah, that, that really explained it. Yeah, that's that's the show right there. <laughs> you hooked us. <laughs> I mean pretty I mean I don't want to say anything that happens in I don't know that Tanner might not see. I mean, I really have only seen like a couple episodes in the season two, so. Of season two? Yeah, I think there's. How many are there? Seven, eight. 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 Oh, I just made that up. I just set a number. Uh, looks like there's ten seasons. Oh. There's ten seasons. But uh, only six or seven episodes in each. Yeah. yeah. Fairly short. So it's, it moves. It gets. All right. Anyone else have a Canadian sitcom they want to promote? Um. <laughs> no. Uh, I'm trying to think what of any that? Canadian sitcoms I've seen. All right, I got one. So Shit's Creek ended last year. Pretty good. Is that Canadian? Is Arrested Development Canadian? I I don't know. It's it's got like. Aren't they from Tennessee? It's American. It's American. I don't it's know American as it gets. Aren't they from Tennessee? America, rest of development? Yeah. Actually, they're from Atlanta. I just they just have a song Tennessee. So I, I thought that's where they were from. What? It's great. It was like filmed in Canada and like originally aired in Canada. Is that how it was? And yeah. then came. Yeah. I never came to the U.S. It was always a. It was always a Canadian show that we just got off of. Yep, it's like syndicated in the U.S. Mm-hmm. You wanna leave it that way? Look, I just my head like this. My lamp almost looks like my bun. Again, Elizabeth is spot on on the visual gags today on uh, audio only. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we should have done something more experimental for episode 20. Something just very much playing with episode the Episode 20? That was a long time ago. Episode hey. 200, excuse me. Yeah, uh, episode 200. Um, just like an audio, not, sorry, excuse me, visual only podcast. <laughs> just something a little bit artsy. Like, try to speak <laughs> as little as possible and let the audience really interpret. Thanks for adding a highlight, Noah. Let the audience <laughs> interpret, you know. I don't know what's going on. I don't like it though. No, it's spamming the add highlight feature. No, no. Keep talking. Keep talking. What were you saying? No, you, you, you ruined it. You're messing with my concentration. I don't even remember what you were talking about. Some, I don't know, experimental podcasts. I don't know. Podcasts where people just talk have been done to death. We need a, a podcast that really breaks the, the, the norms. I don't know. Podcast. Episode 200 would be a place to start. That's what I was thinking, but Daniel didn't come prepared with anything, so I, I, that's really I on him. It's, this, this it's a, a miracle that I... history of getting your episode 200 just banned from existence. I think South Park did What's that. What's the history? Oh, really? South Park. 
their episode 200 is just banned. Like you is that a history it. or one time thing? thing? Is it torrented or something? But like, did it ever air? Or yeah, it aired, and then it aired, and then it's just not existing anymore. Well, this one's got to go up tomorrow. So, <laughs> so, so yeah, air it, and then and then we should do something so controversial that yeah. it has to be banned. Thank you. Uh, already, uh, you'll, you'll, I don't know. Tanner got canceled like a year ago, right? We already did yeah, that. Yeah, so uh, we've already done that. Yeah. Yeah. Already did. Tanner gets it's canceled. like that's, I don't that's old hat. Hot or not? Those cats. What? Like yeah, like bopper flop, hairless cats. Wow, we, I don't know what that what? means. I mean, like <laughs> good or bad. Bop or flop? <laughs> or really flop. spell it out for us. Yeah. Oh is my that, god, is... guys, you're oh. really not that much older than me. How come I'm speaking the Gen because Z? Because technically like you're Gen 45. Z. Well, I guess the voice of our generation. She really I'm, represents us. I am the eldest year of Gen Zs. Like eighty. Uh, okay. What is this uh, from? Uh, is it? Is this from the interwebs? Are cute or no? What hairless cats? Yes. No, they're ugly. Is this some kind of metaphor? Is it, uh... no, I just think they're really cute. <laughs> what do you think? Yeah. What? How do you reason. think? That, nobody thinks they're cute. They just like to have them because they're so out there. Right? I think they're so cute and wrinkly. No, what? Did... I don't know. If you have a hairless cat, you're doing it for attention. Yeah. It's like, a, oh, look at my hairless cat. Aren't I? Cool. Their face I, looks yeah, like this ugly ass with a hammer and stretched out. I can't. I, I didn't know. Like I didn't just know just people talking. were into wrinkles too. I, I didn't know that was it. Yeah, it's thing. like so you said you were. It's you kind liked of funny. The wrinkles. Like, from like behind, they like, look, look like a raw chicken. <laughs> Poor cat. It's, <laughs> it's just they look like they, can, right? they look like E. T. <laughs> 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 So, yeah. so, they do it. so you would want a hairless cat, is what you're saying? If I weren't allergic to it, yes. But if I weren't allergic to cats, I really like the um, Siamese cats. I think they're really cute, too. Wait, can, can you be allergic to a, a hairless cat? There's, like, no dander or, or anything. Probably not. Yeah, I mean, like, it's a saliva. So if they lick you, you, like... Die. You die. Get, yeah. Get itchy. Well, yeah. I won't like die. Yeah, you would die. You, you die. It's straight up just die. Nobody, yep. have a cat. Nobody wants a hero's cat. Yeah. I say we just we could we could turn this episode into a roast of hairless cats. Or just a roast <laughs> episode in general. The roast of Daniel. No. Oh, Daniel. Daniel. No. I don't yeah. know. I'm just yeah, trying we'll to be here think, way guys. too long. No, we've got like. <laughs> Seven yeah. years of built up roast material. Yeah, what a, well, can we hear at least one year? No. In a con quick condensed 30 seconds? No? No. Well, I tried. I'm not ready. I'm not prepared enough. I'm sure Noah has how many years of roast material on me now? Oh, God. Like 12? Over 10? Crazy like that. 10? 10? Yeah, I guess 10, yeah. Almost no? 10. Almost 10. Jeez. Weird. That's um, really weird. No need for almost much. ten years. Pretty much ten years, like besides a month or two or three. Yeah, pretty much. That's wild. That's that. weird. Breaking me out. I feel so old now. How does it make you feel but also makes me feel old? Yeah, but you're younger. By one year. Yeah, that's a year. One whole year. They go through my quarter life crisis this year. Should I throw myself like a rager, where I'm like? No, you went through you went through your quarter life crisis like ten years ago. What does that mean? It means you're gonna die young at sixty. <laughs> <laughs> that's, not, that's, that's a long life. That's it's quality. Oh really? 
No, I'm estimating myself to live to 100, so I'm celebrating it this year. Good luck with that. I mean, I, I honestly think that's possible. I mean, good projection. I was talking to some like, old ladies the other day, and they had a friend who died at 104. Yeah, and you know, advanced. Yeah, and I have a friend who died at seven years. That was a little bit. We, you know, we were talking about living longer. You know what? Yeah, now we're talking about kids. Condolences to your, you know, your dead seven-year-old friend. All my friends are getting married or dying. I don't want to be no, one of your friends know. right now. Face <laughs> <laughs> you got a good chance, one or the other. <laughs> Either die or get married. There's yeah. no in between. Yeah, I already have three weddings to go to next year. Oh my god, do I know any of them? Me. My friend Maddie. She only, went to, she, she... she only went to North Springs freshman year. She played violin. I think I know who that is. Yeah, I remember her. And she, I mean, she went to Georgia Tech too. Yeah. Yeah. She's getting married. Oh, my cousin's getting what? married. So you don't know him. You never know. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you, you, you pretty much. <laughs> I feel like we would have made this connection if we knew him, but... Is his name Michael? Nope. Steve? Nope. Andrew? Nope. Oh, gosh. One last guess. If you get it right, you go into the winning. Quentin! That's my dad's name! It is? <laughs> no, I didn't know that. I didn't actually know that. that. That's such a weird... This is not... This is a pretty uncommon... Not rare, but uncommon name. Yeah, well, so... Yeah, it's he goes by What's Lance. Your What's your first name? Lance? No, my dad goes by Lanny. Because he's named after his dad and his grandpa. And What's so his, his name, name then? Quentin Lance? Lanier. Lanny is short for Lanier. I feel like I've Wait, heard that. The... Lanny. Tanny. Hey, is it okay if we call you Tanny? My cousin's name is Colton. Well, that's like a that's last right. name and a first name. What? Tanny? Tanny? Yeah, we're definitely calling you Tanny from now on. Or Colton. Or, you, I guess Colton is a last name. There was a Professor Colton at Tech. Yeah, his son is my friend. Um, I wouldn't want to be that, that son either. What's he going to do? Die or get married? What's up next with Colton? Okay, any, anyways. You really gotta, you gotta Tanny, ask that. Tanny, Tanny, come on. Yeah, that's down. enough, Tanny. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, Tanny, when are we gonna go to your bar inside your work? Uh. Have you yeah, been there actually, yet? I have. Is it. Explain it to me. Okay, so. Give me, de give me the deets. On the third floor, there is this. Um, bottle shop, like a half bottle shop that has, I guess, some wines and beer that you can buy. And then right as you exit, there is, uh, I guess, an area kind of for lunch, typically. Um, I don't know, maybe 50 feet by 30 feet, but with a couple tables. And so sometimes after work, people go there. What about that doing? It's not a bar. Um, it's not a bar, but you know, people like, buy a six pack and split it among their team. It's a cafe that sells alcohol. Yeah. 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 Isn't that what <laughs> almost a bar is? A cafe that sells <laughs> okay. alcohol. Yeah. Is it like run by your company or is they like no, lease out I, I think it's I think it's yeah, leased out. And you can drink during work? You're not supposed to, but you know, it's a free country. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> fire you. I mean, they can make rules. Yeah, yeah. They, uh, <laughs> they can fire you. Yes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Fact, that is... know, it's allowed, but you you shouldn't. But, you know, <laughs> technically, I, I think if you get fired, that means it's specifically not allowed. <laughs> I don't think no, it's allowed in the sense through. that when you're 21. And in private, in the, in the sense that you won't get arrested. Yeah. Okay. If you're not publicly intoxicated over the age of 21. Like you can get drunk at work at this bar. That's also a 
cafe that sells beer. <laughs> I, did, did that we're all very that confused by this. Elizabeth, do you work from home or do you work in a, in a building with a cafe bar? Um, I go in every day. But do we, don't cafe bar? Every day. we just have a cafeteria. Bar? No. This is a cafeteria that also is a cafe that. It's a cafe that sells beer? No. Hmm. Okay, I just need to, so my cafeteria sells the same food that yeah. or uses the same uh, contractor for Excellent. food as Georgia Tech. Aramark? They're really good at that. Yeah, it's the same food. When I was there, it was Sodexo. They went and then it to changed Europe. to Aramark. They no, then it changed to, to something else in between. They went to like in-house. It's no longer Aramark. Oh, maybe Aramark was the one in between. But like they just you know, That's isn't why they Aramark have... like a an acronym? Used to be like I don't think so. Every part of campus now we have none. What do you say, Elizabeth? Well, like when they switched to the in-house running the campus dining, they got like all the Starbucks. Coffee shops that were on campus aren't there anymore, except for the one in Barnes and Noble. No more Everything brand is names. gone. Yeah. Everything is gone. Yeah, Georgia Tech is really headed downhill. Yeah. Since since I left. Exactly. That, that's gotta that's be the one thing holding that place together. Yeah. In front of the renovated student center. When is that gonna be done? In time for twenty thirty nine. In time for what? Be done oh, this fall next year. That's what I heard. They're taking down the, the, the outside. Like they're doing the inside now. Is the Campano coming back? The Campano, I don't know about whether it's going to be a fountain or not, but the statue's still there. The shaft is coming back? It never went anywhere. It's been there the whole time. No, it hasn't. They took it away. No, they didn't. Yes, they did. Well, if they took it away, they put it back already. Wasn't it gone? Yeah, it was definitely gone. It was definitely gone. I'm 100% sure. Oh, yeah, no, they did yeah. take it away because I thought that they were going to put it where they put that big white statue. But it was it was replaced fairly quickly, though. I don't think it was gone. Mm, it was like a – might have been a year. Just, I was went every time? game. Football two years ago, and it was gone all, every game last year, I mean. So that's at least four months. But I feel like yeah. it was back the time I graduated. I don't know. Whatever. It doesn't really matter. Yeah, the point is that it's there now. But they're getting rid of the fountain, right? Well, so they wanted so, to, and then people petitioned, so I think that they... So they're just keeping everything intact, for lack of a better word? Well, they took yeah. it out. Oh, they took, they, just, they destroyed everything. Out. They might have to put it... They might have to remake it, but... They have to like remake the fountain. Oh, It'll what? be a rain only fountain. They can't afford water. The mock up yeah. that I saw had it like so you know like those like baby pools that you can like it's like sloped so babies can like wade into it instead of just like dropping off like the edge of the pool into the water. It's gonna be yeah. like that. So that. They can drain it so that there's space, I guess, for game day. Woo. Hmm. Hmm. So. Hmm. Uh, Tanny, anything else? Yeah. Tanny. Um, I wish yeah. I had something better prepared for the the two hundred. But I wish <laughs> Daniel, who owns the podcast, had something better. You own it. All of you knew for about a week that this was the two hundredth episode. Well, so. I wasn't going to do anything. I'm a very busy man. This is, I'm not. I'm not getting paid for this. I'm not seeing a single cent. Yeah. You guys are all like getting paid. Me some, some money, then you I'll, guys want to get I'll paid start. for this? Would you like yes. a cut of the profit? Yes. Dan, are you still living from home? Yes. Well, then you don't have to pay rent. So that's your money. <laughs> that's the money you earn from the podcast. You have a cafe it's, bar. It's, it's, I mean, that's where all your money's going. Clearly. Unless your parents are making you pay rent. No, my, my parents are actually paying Daniel, pay me for this podcast, oh. and the rent that I wouldn't be paying. 
that made any sense. C, that doesn't make sense. Wait. Never mind. No? Okay. No, I get it. I get it. Okay, that's good. Do you think it's worth it to go to a Braves game so that right. I can get to, like, specifically on the, like, replica World Series ring day giveaway? When? Because I have a fake World Series ring. Oh, I want one of those. When? They're not doing a giveaway of a replica because those are like six hundred dollars. They're plastic. Okay, but the 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 replica ones are the six hundred dollar ones. Like they uh, they sell those. They're not the real ones because those are probably worth tens of thousands of dollars. The plastic ones are worth six hundred. No. No, the replicas are worth six hundred. This might be a replica of the replica. I think it's a replica of the replica. Like the like a plastic. I'm really confused. Like, the pants. Yeah. It's a fancy, fancy one. It's just like plastic. What when? What date? June eighth and July eleventh. It's my birthday. Both of those actually. <laughs> I won't what do you say? It's not. What? It's not. It's not your birthday. June eighth is my birthday. Mm, those dates don't work oh, for me. Can we go a different day? June 8th is a Wednesday, which is a problem. My dudes. And July 11th, I'll already be moved to New York. So I'm like... Well, if you go to a Braves game, let me know, because I'll go. Okay. When, are we, going to, when are we going to New York? When am I going now? June. No, you can't go in June. I won't be there yet. When are you going? July? Yeah, I'm moving up in early July. I could do that. That'll fit in my schedule. Actually, we can plan this off fast. Let's plan it on the podcast. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. It seems experimental because it's like the structure isn't there at all. It's just planning out a Braves game. No, that's not even what they're doing. No, we're planning planning on a trip. Yeah. The New York crew. Uh, Podcast fans can come meet us in New York. <laughs> yeah, all the podcast fans listening on Anchor.fm right now, please leave an audio. Hey, Daniel, if you are in the New York area, when are you quitting your job? <laughs> I can't quit my job. They need me. They're they? begging me to come in to work today. And I really? So you're like, and said yes. Did you get paid over? Over? Yeah. Overtime? No, I get paid overtime, but yeah. And I ended up getting a pretty cushy job today, so it wasn't terrible. It actually kind of worked out. But we're about to be at, like, minimum manning. When are you quitting and yeah. moving to civilization? Civilization? Now people are moving up here. It's kind of a hot spot. Yeah, you and your three people? He's, he's saving up money living up there, right? No. Yeah. How much do you pay in rent, Daniel, if you don't mind me asking? You can type the number in the chat if you don't feel comfortable. It's going up. Yeah. What's that, Elizabeth? New York rent is expensive. This is Schenectady. Yeah, but I live in the middle of nowhere, so it was. Right now I'm paying this amount. What that the heck? Got, still? Seriously? But, that's so little. $740. But it's it's going up to, so, so we got new land. Oh land my God, so It's going up to so that. Little. It's going up to that now. It's, it's a, it's a one-bedroom apartment. It's probably about 700 square feet. It's not like... Less than I paid for my home park house room. Yes. Like I said, it's, it's the middle of nowhere, so so rent is pretty cheap here. This this is all, That's also one of the cheaper rents in the area for, like, a level of place. Like, you can pay, like, 600 for, like... This is how much I pay. A dive place, but... Yeah, see, That's I don't pay that man. much less than Noah, all things considered. Yeah, but I have a good deal. Well, not really. You also share a place. You also have a roommate. How much do I pay? Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I, dropped, I dropped a number in the chat. I don't, I don't want you guys to read it aloud on the. Yeah, we won't read how much Tanner pays, but it's, 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 a, it's a lot of zeros. This is, ow, this is my rent for my studio. Do you this live like, is my downtown room. Greenville? And this yeah, is my rent crazy. when I go to New York. That's a bit nuts. 
I don't even live in Dallas. Much. That's not like that much. Where exactly? Like where exactly are you living in New York? In Schenectady. In well, downtown the... Schenectady. Downtown Schenectady. That's just, that sounds like someone sneezed and had an aneurysm at the same time. It kind it's of good. Still <laughs> it took me a long time to figure out how to pronounce it. Next it's time. it's complicated, but there is a movie based that's called it. Well, I guess you can't watch it now. It's good, but Schenectady still still should not be uh, that. That expensive. That like My dad went to college right near there, so maybe you'll visit. Where? Huh? He went to Union. Well, it's, that is in Schenectady. That's what I mean. You'll, you'll have to visit. Okay. Everyone quiet. I think... Oh, never mind. Never mind. Oh, never mind. There's no bill. There's, he has a scholarship in his name. Yeah. Why are we being quiet for Noah? Is he it's going the, on? It's like, the downtown area, and that was like on the cheaper end for the area I'm living in. Let's see. Let me try to buy a place in or rent a place. Okay. Okay. The video on the chat. Video in the chat. Guys. For our listeners, Noah is putting a video in the chat. I would not click on that. It's it's can't be good, right? No, no, no. Click on the video, Elizabeth. I'm not clicking on it. It's it's got to be a virus, right? It's no, just it's literally just it's, it's like pronunciation guy. It's how to pronounce Schenectady. You click on it and screen share it. <laughs> it's got to be a virus, right? All right, let's see. So I'm, on, I'm on Zillow here. These are expensive, but there are a lot of options. I'll give you that much. Hey, Elizabeth. Yep. It's this... What the fuck is this video? Oh gosh. Okay, so for our listeners, know what is uh video sharing game the screen. donkey. Oh, that did Click on the video game donkey one. I couldn't hear it. Dude, my, my 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 computer's like suck a hunna ek and a tagne. Suck a hunna ek and a tagne. That is so incorrect. Suck a hunna ek and a tagne. Suck a hunna ek and a tagne. Alright, Elizabeth, I found this one studio place. That's six hundred eighty-five dollars. Is it in the? Um... It doesn't have walls, um, but <laughs> what is it? Just a <laughs> who needs a walls? It's just, it's just... <laughs> no, no, it looks fine. Hold on, it's loading. My computer is really struggling right now. I already, I already have a place. Yeah, I know. I'm just, I was just looking. It's curious. It is. It, it does look more expensive than it should be for a, a middle of. Kind of a middle of nowhere city. Maybe it, just because, like, it's in the it's Albany a... market now. I don't know. So wait, it's a suburb of Al- Albany? How do you say it here? That's how the video is. Yeah, the, the, the video channel is just, it's just mispronouncing words. It's really funny. It was actually quite enjoyable. I did yeah. Oh, it is right next to Albany. Like if I put my... It's right next to Climax. <laughs> next to what? The greatest city in New York. Climax, Climax City. New York. It's, it's, not, it's pretty close to Climax, New York. <laughs> <laughs> Climax, can we go to Climax City? No, it, it actually is. It's. It, That's the coolest name for a city I've ever heard. Also, it's right next to Am- Amsterdam. It's it's only it's only it's only thirty minutes away from climax. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How many more times this podcast goes on much longer? <laughs> climax <laughs> City. <laughs> we have to wrap it up soon. Dude, uh, freaking Schenectady is near. Ready for this? Pattersonville, Glenville, Fultonville, Gloversville, Baker, Barkersville. The, what the, just Mechanicville. Why can't they have, find better names besides somethingville? Lawyersville. I'm actually this is a pretty good name. Lawyersville. Charlotteville. Not Charlottesville. Charlotteville. One singular Charlotte. 
Yeah, well, one thing about Charlottesville. Climax. It's also near Bald really Mountain. Close. It's near Bald Mountain. So it's a non possessive ville of Charlotte. Yeah, but uh, it's also near Great Sacanadagada Lake. <laughs> I can still don't know how you say it. Sacanadaga. Near what? Isn't that Sacanadaga? This place well, is looking for this climax. lake. I don't even see it. Is it's a very climax? big lake. You can't miss it. Like it's bigger than anything else that's even close. Hold on. I see the river. No, is no, it... no. Zoom out. You gotta zoom out. Jack in the dark. Is it this small one here? No, it's big. It's huge. Lake Ontario. No, not that big. Biggest lake in the in the country. Is I it... see it. Oh, Grand Second Dagger no, Lake. No, great. 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 It's not. It's, it's great. great. It's not Dagger grand. Lake. It's oh. it's only great. Northville, <laughs> Liversville. They really do have a lot of those. Yeah, it's they great. didn't really try. There's Colony. There's a museum of si of innovation and science. Castleton on That's what? a good name. What? Also, don't don't worry, there is a, there is a Popeyes. Is, is, is what? Castleton on Hudson? That's a name. Okay, scroll down a little bit. And then a little bit more on that highway, 87, right? Wait, I'm on 9J. Oh, I'm on 87. New Baltimore? Okay, scroll down a little bit, right? Dude. You gotta zoom in a lot and scroll down there, right? Are, are you, um... Referring to C O X S A C K I E next to Climax? Oh, no, I was just referring to Climax. There's a Cox right next to Climax? What is it? I don't Go know what Elizabeth oh, spelled. <laughs> Cox and Climax. Sacky. What is Cox Sacky? What the heck? I wasn't even, I didn't even see that. Why is Climax right next to Cox Sacky? <laughs> also next to Earlton. What is this? It can't be how New York is a it. joke. That's what we've learned. New York is just Fox a joke. Sacked. Oh my There's god. A Tannersville. There's a Tannersville. There's a Coxsackie yeah. virus. How do you spell Coxsackie? That's Coxsackie. That's Coxsackie. Climax is actually a hamlet town of Coxsackie. I feel oh, like they just took locations in Georgia and added Ville to the end of it. Oh no, they just took with names. It's just names. Just like any name of any city. Columbiaville. Hollowville. Boyce Boyceville. Bushnellsville. I don't know how. This Fleischmannsville. Margaretville. Alcottsville. I'm gonna zoom in randomly in Virginia and see what I get. Shinhopple. I got Appomattox. That's not how you Thank pronounce you. that. Should be though. It should be. That is not how you pronounce that. Appomattox? I'm going with Appomattox. You you know it's like a very very famous place, right? No, I, I know appreciate the confidence. Oh, oh my god, no! I appreciate the confidence. Appomattox. Oh, it is Appomattox. I thought it was Hippopotamus. You guys know Sleepy Hollow is also in New York. Right next to White Plains. Where is it? Well, the, the town of like Sleepy Hollow, I think. Where it... going to a random city in, in 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 the country? What is it going to be? Boom! Hollow. Zooming in right here. We are in, ladies and gentlemen. Canada, We Climax, are in South Dakota. There was literally no city within 100 miles of this place. Oh my God! Okay, we're going to a different place. There is no city. 
I think it was the middle of the desert. Definitely. Right here. Right here. Random city. What is it going to be? Ladies and gentlemen, we are in Jasper, Indiana. That's actually a big city. That's a, yeah, that's a. What the heck? That was one. That was a very big city. Is this. Is this London, Michigan? London? This is Canada. There's a city That's okay, I'm in Ireland. I'm in Ireland, Indiana. What are we doing here? What is this segment? I don't know. This is a weird I, thought, I, thought, I, thought the, I thought the recording ended. <laughs> is the recording <laughs> still <laughs> We're still on the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing here? Okay, so I think the whole episode 200 was kind of a, a subversion of what you think because it's not actually a podcast at all. It's just looking at random towns in America. <laughs> what it might be. I think Have you been, oh, here's French Lick Indianapolis. Or French Lick French Indiana. Lick? Real podcast was the friends we made along the way. Happy to Yes, there you go. That's, that's episode 200. There it is. Write that down, Daniel. I... <laughs> Did you? <laughs> That's good. I'm, right, I'm writing things. Yeah, jot that one down because I think that's the, yeah. the title of the, the podcast, or at least the description. Nice job. Est Court, this. Maine. And if you made it this far in the podcast thing, then I really thank you and I salute you. They deserve you really a prize. To, yeah, you you really deserve a prize. I go ahead and leave an audio comment and I'll message you ten dollars on Venmo, like. <laughs> You'll, you say you'll message someone Sorry, ten dollars. Well, yes. Yeah. Yeah, he's I'll gonna message, message you. Ten dollars. I'll like message you ten dollars. Like way to say that. I think. Well, I'll message you ten dollars. Ten of Daniel's dollars. Uh, Daniel from Copper. No, you guys want to get paid or not? Money. <laughs> I need some rent money. Yeah. <laughs> if I yeah, this is the thing. If I pay one of you fans for getting it this far, I won't be able to pay rent. So if you guys. <laughs> You know, really want to see me struggle financially? Oh, listen this far, I guess. He needs he needs cafe bar money. Yeah, I need I need money to go to the cafe, but for beer. That place. Well, thank you guys so much for listening to episode two hundred of the podcast, and just remember, the real episode was the friends we made along the way. Mm-hmm.